All right, guys, so Savannah just messaged us and said that we needed to get over to the Gator Marsh. Something exciting is about to happen. Let's go. There's just like hot dogs everywhere. This is crazy. Adventurers, we are currently at Gatorland. They're having a really exciting event this weekend. It's called Gator Palooza, and they're actually getting ready to do something really exciting back here in the Gator Marsh. I know it involves Savannah, I know it involves gators, and I know it involves something to do with food. So if that's not gonna be an exciting show, I don't know what is. So the cool thing about Gator Palooza is it actually includes vendors, some live music, and special food. So they have all kinds of little tent set up with people that have merchandise to sell so it's a lot of fun I cannot tell you guys how much it is happening here today this is the place to be today like we got here and the line was almost down the block so it was insane uh, beautiful day though like it is a perfect day to be hanging out at Gatorland So we just wanted to first and foremost say thank you so much to Gatorland for having us out today on your birthday, Gator Palooza. Happy birthday, Gatorland. Happy birthday to you. He says, what's happening? I feel like there should be Jaws music playing, except for maybe the alligator version. It is a beautiful day here at Gatorland, guys. Look at these cute little juvenile gators. They're getting some fish. We might have to do this a little bit later. This is fun. So cute. Look at this guy. He's just in there hanging out with the gators, trying to blend. So check it out, guys. One of the things that Gatorland is known for is the fact that they have a couple of leucistic alligators. Leucistic alligators, for those of you that don't know, are very, very rare. I believe there are only 12 in the entire world. And Gatorland has a few of them. I'm not sure exactly how many, but it's a pretty awesome thing. So the biggest difference between leucistic alligators and albino alligators is the eyes. The eyes will be pink in albino alligators, but in leucistic alligators, they are normally either blue or black. So that's a really interesting tidbit of information. My guess is this is a female. It looks like she's building a nest here. See that nest? Oh, yeah. Look at that. That is pretty cool. It's about that time where they start laying their eggs. This is the first time, guys, that we have seen this enclosure. And it's pretty amazing. I mean, it literally looks just like a spring. So I don't know if this is actually spring water. It would be really hard to replicate this. Yeah, I know this is piping it in. Yeah. She's yeah. actually turning around off of her nest. She might go down this, uh, this is an alligator trail here. Like yeah, she might water. slide. Like I said, this is such a cool enclosure. And we've never seen this enclosure. This is our first time here uh, since they've been moved to this area. But wow, what a beautiful area. If I was an alligator, I would want to be right here. This is this would be my spot. Hey guys, Jen and I are having a great time. This is one of our favorite Florida adventure parks. It has everything people come to see in Florida: the gators, snakes. I don't know. There's like a plethora. It's just like so cool here. Here's a little bit more information for you guys about leucistic alligators. So apparently they do have a little bit of pigment, whereas albinos have none. So that explains why. Albino alligators have the pink eyes and leucistic have either blue or black because they do have something that sometimes have little spots. How's it going, buddy? All right, guys, so Savannah just messaged us and said that we needed to get over to the Gator Marsh. Something exciting is about to happen. Let's go. Oh, he's got the, he's got the gator coming. That's not Oh, he does? <laughs> Oh my goodness, you are gorgeous. 
absolutely beautiful. Whatever it was, they wanted it. Look at this koi. Where? Right here. How did he I don't know. Wow, that's beautiful. Unless it's a giant goldfish. Might be a giant goldfish. Look at this brave, great blue heron, guys. He is. He's braver than I would be. Look at this beautiful bird, guys. She actually has eggs. And when she saw me walking over, she sat back on her nest because she's trying to protect her babies. So that's pretty cool. They're beautiful blue eggs. All right, guys, they're getting ready to have the show. Apparently, they're going to be passing out hot dogs. And Savannah and someone else is going to be in their boat and trying to catch them. And I guess whatever they don't catch, these guys are going to catch. So that is going to be pretty cool. I think these guys can smell the hot dogs in the air. Look at them. They're excited. Look how excited they are. There you go. We are celebrating Gator Palooza, our 72nd birthday here at Gatorland. So if you guys oh, want to join us and have some fun, wow. come grab some hot dogs, grab a spot on the tower, and we'll be starting up here in 15 minutes. They know. <laughs> Look at them. The excitement is, is building. I've never seen them have their tail up. Yeah. What? He's getting ready to, to act crazy again. Okay. So Lisa just went to the store. I mean, wagon. just went to the wagon and got some dogs. So we are going to chuck these out. Yeah, do not eat the hot dogs. They are edible, but they are not cooked. And I don't want anyone getting sick. Did you take a bite? They technically are cooked. Ew. But. Everybody's got their hot dogs all lined up down here. That's so funny. Put it on their net. All right, guys, they are launching their boats. So it's about to get real in here. Just a couple minutes. Who do you think is going to catch the most? Who, th who thinks Savannah's going to catch the most? Woo! All right, who thinks Bubba's going to catch the most? I, was that a boo? I'm so glad they're taking safety precautions and wearing flotation devices so the gators can find them. <laughs> <laughs> Savannah, Baba, how you guys doing out there? I'm the only one paddling! You're the only one paddling? <laughs> You're doing great so far. <laughs> so guys, Savannah has spikes on her hat. I'm going to try and land a hot dog right on that hat. We'll see how good my aim is. The gators are getting super excited, guys. They know it's about to go down. Come closer. Come closer. Come closer. <laughs> <laughs> Savannah's going in for it. All right, here we go. Five, four, three, two, one. Toss the hot dogs. Wow. Whoever catches the most will win the competition for 2021 Gator Palooza. No She's way. Gonna use your hat. Whoa, I don't see anybody catching any. Oh, we got some great arms out here on the tower. Oh, we win. Oh. oh, I hear a couple going. Look at all the hot You're dogs flying through the air. There's just like hot dogs everywhere. This is crazy. On the stairs here, if you guys want to grab some real quick. It's pure insanity. Oh, I hear Did she get one on her hat? I hit it. Keep on chucking up, trying to get in the pocket. Don't forget there is a winner. Oh, you got to take it out of the boat. That's cheating. Look at all the hot dogs, guys. This is so crazy. So, then you're supposed to be looking for hot dogs. You guys are doing great. Keep on chucking. Aim for Bubba's mouth. Go all the way up there. Oh, 
we throw it? It looks like we're running low on hot dogs. You guys are doing great. We got one more minute. One more minute. You guys are almost done. Yeah. All right, Otto, it's coming down the end. Oh, that one went right in the bucket. It's raining hot dogs. Here we go, 10, 9, 8, 7, 6, 5, 4, 3, 2, 1 and a half, 1, and hold your hot dogs, hold your hot dogs. How do you, how you guys think they did out there? Hold up your buckets and see what you got. Uh-oh, that's not too many. You know what, look, it's kind of hard for me to see. So let, you guys have to help me out on this one. If you guys think Savannah caught the most hot dogs, let's hear it, Team Savannah. Yeah! Oh, no, that's not too bad. If you think Bubba caught the most hot dogs, let's hear it, Team Bubba. Yeah! That is close. That is close. We're going to have to do it one more time. This is Florida, we do recounts. If you guys think so, let's hear it for Savannah! If you think Bubba won the competition, let's hear it for Savannah! That is close, but we're going to 2021 Gator Palooza champion is Savannah! Awesome job, thank you guys so much for coming out for 2021 Gator Palooza. Come on back next year and celebrate Gator Lynn's birthday. We appreciate y'all. You guys have fun today. Look, he's got a hot dog. There is a beautiful pink spoonbill up here waiting for us to come by. What are you doing, buddy? This little guy's just lurking, waiting to see if anybody drops any hot dogs his way. Sorry, bud, I don't have any. That was some show for sure, guys. That was pretty cool. It definitely takes a lot of guts to get out in the middle of the Gator Marsh in a small John boat. Oh, this guy's getting some food. He's a happy gator. That guy just got something too, that um, that heron. Oh, what he's got. It might be a piece of hot dog, not sure. All aboard! Some beautiful blue and gold macaws here, guys, just hanging out in front of the train station. If they could talk, they'd say, oh wait, they can talk. Do you guys say, all aboard? For Gator Palooza, they have empanadas today. It looks really good. Why don't you go ahead and dig into that? Let's see what's inside of that. We're gonna split this one. Yeah, it does have carbs in it, guys. It's not a carb-free empanada. So Sick. we're gonna watch as Lisa cuts into it. Look at pie crust. Sometimes you do have to treat yourself though. Yes, you don't get these everywhere. We had these at St. Thomas, this uh, homemade empanada. It was the best. Oh my. Let's see. Oh. If it tastes as good as it smells, we are in for a treat. Mmm. Good. Mm. Awesome. So guys, I just want to show you also, if, if you guys didn't notice, right behind Lisa, awesome swamp buggy experience is so, so cool. If you ever get a chance to go to Gatorland, be sure to do this because it's awesome. So here is the splash pad. It looks refreshing about now. We're going to take a walk down here. See what there is to see. Pretty sure they have some animals down this way. We're gonna find out. I'm pretty sure uh, last time they did. Looks like they do have some more vendors down here, which is cool. I know we haven't shown a whole lot of the vendors, but there are quite a few of them here. And that makes it all the more exciting today because you never know what kind of cool stuff you can find. Super clean. Sanitize. There is a Galapagos tortoise over there.
Check it out, he's got his own splash pad right here in his enclosure. That's pretty cool. Oh, there's some baby gators in here. Let's go check those out. Look at these little guys. Oh, you're so cute. Look at these babies. They're adorable. All right, all right, all right, all right. What's up, little guys? A couple gators just hanging out over here, seeing what everybody's doing. They're just people watching. Saying, hey, what are you buying over there at that tent? I know Lisa hates it when I do this, but I just want to show you guys how accessible Gatorland actually is. Super accessible. So if you have any type of mobility issue, do not be afraid to go on a Gatorland adventure. They got you covered. Wow, we are just in time. The Panthers are just waking up. Look at this. This is a rare treat. <laughs> How cool. Taking a little drink. Oh man, they are beautiful. So these are actually Florida Panthers, uh, also known as a Puma. And they are so, so cool. Look at that face. Oh. Big kitty. Looks a little older. He just laid back down and now he's looking at us. Check that out. That's so cute. Oh. They call these the snakes, apparently. Okay, so that's cool. This one, though, this is the split snake. What happens here? You get in circles. <laughs> Not sure which one to follow anymore. Are you going to go take a dip in that water park, Lise? Yeah. I have my water too. This is a really cool directory. Where are we going, Lise? Check Look out. at her new hat. Check it out. I got this here. This is. I sell she Stetson. finally got a Stetson. This the quality of this is amazing. It has real leather. So now she's ready to go out on safari with me. Well, I don't have a horse, so I just bought the hat. I mean, that's cool. Now you got to just get the horse. <laughs> this is cool. It's like the old time, like we were in yesterday, like an old time Florida store. Yep. This is the uh, Gator Gully General Store. Let's just peek in here real quick and see what kind of cool stuff they have in here. Just in case you forget your bathing suit. They got you covered, guys. You can just come right in here, pick yourself up a bathing suit, or they have all kinds of different things. They have hats and sunscreen and sanitizer, drinks, ice cream, a little bit of everything in here. So look, they even have these really cool hats that I love. I love these kind of hats. So guys, this is Chester, also known as the dog eater. It was actually caught. Uh, because he was reported for uh, eating dogs. So he was actually caught in Tampa and relocated here for his forever home. He's a big boy. We actually got to go in there with him one time and he was not in a very good mood. They were actually draining his pool. But today he looks pretty happy. So we're gonna keep on our way, but this guy is so big. All right, guys, so we just got our bag of gator chow. Look at this. We're getting ready to grab one out and see who's hungry. You want one, buddy? He says, maybe if you get it closer. All right, we're going to try to get a little closer to his snout. Here it is. Oh, there he goes. He's going in for it. He is going in for it. Thank you for that. I appreciate that. That's all they wanted. Just a little gator action. And you did not disappoint. 
So what kind of treat do you have there? So guys, as you, most of you know, I, ha I can't have sugar because I just found out I have diabetes. So they have fresh squeezed lemonade over here and you can get it with or without sugar. Really? Or you can get it mixed with a little bit of sugar because I said it's like unsweetened really sour. She's like, yeah. So she added, like kind of diluted it, but it doesn't taste extremely sweet. Let me try it. I'm sure that's it's a, really refreshing. I'm sure that's a lot less carbs than right. That's really it's good. It's almost like lemon order with the, just a little bit of sweetener, right? Hey, check out my lemonade. Sorry, <laughs> just kidding. It was really good. Is it good? <laughs> yeah, it's really good. Yeah, I thought it's definitely better than a soft drink. I was waiting to see if she would say something. I knew she was going to eventually. Gator, 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 gator. The birds start coming when you start calling the gators. Come on. Gator, 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 gator. There's, there's one there. Oh, they're coming. Yeah. Gator, 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 gator. Here they come. All right. Do it again. Gator, gator, gator. Gator, 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 gator. Hey, gator, hey, gator, hey, gator. Oh, here it comes. Oh, here it comes. Oh, yes. That was a nice pitch, Lise. Here he's coming for it. Here he's coming for it. There he goes. Nice. We have splashed down. Isn't it funny how they eat? Like they, you think they would just like ferociously chomp and it's like, I don't know. And then they're like sideways. Yeah, but sometimes they do. And you know what it seems like it depends on? It seems like if there's competition. Yeah. That's when they really go in on it. Here he goes. Crikey. we just attempted a live stream if you were actually there we appreciate it we had some issues with it dropping service so we hope you enjoy the vlog so guys this is the petting zoo here at Gatorland they have a lot of nice animals they have a bunch of goats an emu I'm trying to see what else they have over there they have uh, some capybaras those are really cool look at the goats they're just hanging out over here on their playground they're talking to us too. They even have pressed pennies here. Look at these guys. There's a mama and a baby. So cute. Aren't they the cutest? Alright guys, so this is really important. These are what cane toads look like. And cane toads are actually venomous and they can actually kill your pets. So this is something you don't see every day. A bobcat on a hot tin roof. What's up buddy? What you doing? You are just living large up there, aren't you? That is so cool. What's he going to do? Where's it going? There he comes. So you can feed them inside, right? Also known as parakeets. They actually sell food sticks, I believe, and you get to go in through there. You come in here and I guess they land on you. Yeah, there's we have a... not done that yet. We might have to do that next time. Yeah. Leave us a comment, guys, if you want us to do that next time we come here. That would be fun. It's really clean in there, too, for all those birds. I don't know if they have, um... They just cleaned it out. There's a lot of dishes there, too. There's a lot of them. This is the ultimate bird aviary for these type of birds really yeah. so happy i would love to have like a small aviary for simon now up top that's like fresh air too right and um yeah 
But it's nice because they have some shelter over there for them. Oh, yeah, there's shelter so back there. The right, okay. And they have these little roosting boxes also. Right. It's awesome. It is. It's really cool. Hello? You guys talk? Hello? Hello? Cracker? Cookie? Hello? Pretty bird. Pretty bird. Did you enjoy yourself at Gator Mobile? Good. Where are we heading? To the exit? What's at every exit? A gift shop. <laughs> I didn't buy anything today, so I'm about to get my buy on. Uh oh, Jen said she's getting her her buy on. These are two to four year old alligators. Wow, look at these dudes. These ones are huge. They got a nice little platform there for them so they can just max and relax in the sun. There's an even better view of these guys. Wow. Couple really big ones there. Pretty awesome.